Welcome back to another episode of Densetsu Rama. Welcome to Pokemon Ruby Part 3 is what it is. If it's wrong, editor, fix it. Welcome back, everybody. I'm Ty, and this is Coyote, and we are currently in Viridian Forest? Is that a thing? <laughs> oh, uh, what, Petalburg? Petalburg, that's it. Yeah, it's Petalburg. Unless it isn't. We So, got no berries... No bear. Oh yeah, we're in a bad place right now. We won that, but we got our ass kicked by that Ninkata, Ninkata, whatever. Actually, I might have a berry. I think you have one more Orin. Two. Does Pecha bring any? Poison. No, just poisoning. Poisoning, uh, though. Okay. We need to buy some shit. <sighs> so just running over Tanukis till I get levels. They are good for that. That's not good for EV training. Oh, it's probably a good thing we didn't commit to the Nuzlocke. I killed two-thirds of the team already. Eh, we'll save the Nuzlocke for, um... It's my fault. It's fine. What are they gonna do, just throw bugs at me? Just gets... Just what, did it by What are they gonna Nikita. do, leave a comment? Don't leave a comment. <laughs> like, comment, and subscribe. You know what? <laughs> I, I, I don't even care. I want that interaction. Dislike this video. Dislike the video. Lo like, dislike, and subscribe if you want to see content similar it to this one. It is all attention. Can you even dislike? Is the dislike button still there? It, I think. Can you see the number of dislikes? Because I know it, they hit it at one point. I was under the impression it served no, like... Purpose? Yeah, it, say, it serves the same purpose as the up button. I mean, on one hand, it helped get the Sonic the Hedgehog design changed for the live-action movie... Yeah, but it's not going to cancel Rings of Power or anything. It... Yeah... It's not going to cancel... What was that other... What was that game? It's not going to cancel... Hey, you know what we're not sponsored by? Diablo Immortal. Oh my god. I, I, I don't know. I, I still had... I still got some friends. They're holdouts. They're just like, No, it's not that bad, I swear. From what I've seen, the game itself is it, perfectly fine. But the paywalls on it, and uh, this this is from other people's mouths. I have not tried it myself. So that is other people's to talk about. I have not tried it myself. Could you rest in this house? I thought you could. Or did they just give you shit? They gave me some berries out front. I'm trying not to get in any more fights. Maybe that's it. Okay, it's oh, okay. yeah, we're in trouble. There's a double battle on that bridge up ahead. Yeah, it was just giving me the double battle sign tutorial, so I'm like, no, I don't want to learn about berries. Is there you nowhere eat them. to rest? Seriously? I swear there was somewhere you could rest out here. Four. Probably not back there. There's an item back here, though. Hoping it's a potion or something. Maybe. Poochina will let you well grab it. escape. Poochina gives a guaranteed escape. Poochina's unconscious. Fuck! Oh, yeah, that, this might be a problem. Just the old fish dog. There we go. Yeah, our Mudkip's beefy, though. It's all right. He's pretty beefy. Hope that's something. Yeah, there we go. That might get us... Th I don't think it's going to get us through that double battle. No, I, I would need two Pokemon to probably get through that double battle. Do we battle. have a fishing pole? No. Damn. Is that a trainer? Hi, lady. Must have been fated to meet. Ask you for a battle? Oh, okay. Oh, oh I did, you didn't look like a battler. Oh, I thought you knew. I thought you were just battling, and I was like, oh, all um, right. Sure, it'll be fine. It's oh, just yeah. another Tanuki on the pile. Yeah. Get wet. We probably should have. <laughs> Damn. I was going to say, we probably should have potioned up, but yeah, I guess we didn't need it. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, fuck you, Lady Sin. She's like, oh, my. Yeah. You like apples? How do you oh, like that oh, son man. of a bitch? It was right on the edge of the screen. Oh, they knew. Should I or shouldn't I? Okay, Ooh. all right. Okay. To beef okay. or not to beef? Oh, shit. Oh, oh no, no, bro. It just... Is Lotad also a water ground, I thought? Should, should we even try to save it? Yeah. Yeah, we, we might. I, I could pull this bag. Might be a, we could do whack. Pull on the back. Oh, he's using status moves instead of all attack moves, like a chump. It's okay. We're using Eat status this mud moves. Slap. I guess it does damage, it doesn't count. 
I am definitely one of those Pokemon scrubs that's like, I need four attack moves on my Pokemon, all of them, no status moves. Mm. Because big it brain... It depends on the status. Big brain DPS. Yeah, but what about poison? Poison's great. Say, I... I'm not a min-maxer when it comes to Pokemon. I don't know how. I really like Mawile because Mawile has access to most mouth beam based moves. So your Mawile can have Hydro Pump, Flamethrower, uh, whatever the electric one is. Shock Cannon? Electro Cannon? Something like that? And Ice, yeah. and ice Beam. All four of them. And I love doing that on Mawile. Okay, that's pretty good. I like that a lot. You always have a type advantage. Because Mawile is steel. So it's also pretty damn beefy. Say, don't like the fact that our two are dead. Because now, uh, now the XP you know, share is kind of off. Yeah. And I'm about to get tore up by the Shroomish. No, oh, he's fine. Never mind. Uh, no. Maybe. Maybe. It's all falling apart. No, oh, yeah, yeah, we're good. Okay. He's not that great. Being being twice its level, uh It really helps. It doesn't is, hurt. Is this how Ash does it? I mean Fuck Titan. When did damage. Ash get it done? Plot armor. The one time he became champion in the Sun and Moon anime. He did. He became champion finally. He, they championed that kid so hard he got a different design. He got yeah, he went back to being ten years old. Okay. I am there's a double battle up here. That's going to be real rough. Do we want to just make the run back? Or do we want more berries? There's no one in here to talk to. I could have sworn. I would like a second Pokemon. The more attention to get flowers, the more beautiful they bloom. You like tending to the flowers of it. You, you can have this. We get a... Old Whalmer Pale. Old Whalmer Pale. Also a fairly forgotten Pokemon. Whalmers? I feel like it. I feel like they don't get... Well, I think Pokemon... The, the devs work themselves into a corner with a Pokemon that they will never be able to aren't, render at full size. Aren't Whalmers supposed to be, like, lighter than the air, though? Because they're really huge and, like... Was that a thing? They... Well, I don't think they meant for it to be a thing, but every Pokemon had a weight in the Pokedex, and Whalmers just weren't as heavy because they were, like, whales, but it was, like, the weight of a normal Pokemon. Yeah, I feel like... I think Whalmer and Pokemon Snap the new one, which we should also play. That is a great game. It's definitely a relax relaxing. Is that is that a good way to say boring? Yeah. But it's still a good game to play. I feel like we could have a chill out. Uh, we might stream it. Maybe we'll uh, maybe we'll stream some Pokemon Snap. That might be fun. Okay. Yeah, I hate to do it, but we gotta run back. That's probably fair. We'll probably end up having to go make the trip anyways. The only thing we could have done is taken the L and uh, saved ourselves the trip back. But, uh, is that the guy being chased? Oh, yeah, Mr. Briny. Later on, I think he'll take you on his boat. Yeah, he's not here now. Not here. That is a late later game thing. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, man. It's not good. It's okay. There's trainers on that beach, so we probably took the easier route anyways. No, uh, Way Whalmer evolves into Waylord, and the devs work themselves into a corner with never being able to render Waylord at his cannon size ever again. Except in Sword and Shield, where you can see full-size Waylord off in the distance in the ocean. And it's really cool. Waylord's just out in the ocean. We know they're there, but, you know, they're, they're in the ocean. It's deep down. Oh, no, you can go up to them. You can battle them. They're just the, it's like the size of a, like a one-story building. Just floating in the ocean, you can run into him. I really appreciated that. What? Well, my lords are so cool. My lords are cool. They're just too big. I'm trying to remember the story. But shout out to the guy who was just like... I, I thought it was really sad that Lapras were endangered. So I, he just bred Lapras's and just kept hitting release on them. And that's how he was playing Pokemon. Man. What a life. What a life. I mean... It's like the life of a of a Skyrim villager, you know. You could play the game that way, but it's, it's a thankless task. It ain't much, but it's honest work. Okay, so before we get back into it, did you buy anything? 
Oh, I did not. I should have bought some potion. Eh, we're not too far from the next town. We just need to get across no, this bridge. Fine. Yeah, we'll be alright. Say. Don't have to clear out all these trainers again. They're done flinging their bugs at me. They're done flinging shit. And then this stuff's just flinging out of the woods. Hey! Silk. Already evolved Silcoon? Uh. Maybe? I don't remember which one evolved into Watch. This one evolves into Beautiful Eye. Alright, I like Dusk. I like Dusk Ox. Is that it? Dusk Ox? Dust Tox. Dust Ox. There's a T in there, yep. I think. Now you got me questioning it. Uh, wow. Ten minutes in, we've already gaslit ourselves. <sighs> oh no. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. I just like Dust Ox better. So that was just was like the real dog meat. You just battled by throwing a grenade at your dog. And he's invincible. <laughs> it's fine. Yeah, the people do just like target the dog. And it's so much more funny when um, you don't have a, a human NPC. Well, in like the third Fallout, you can get like an ability. It's like if your dog dies, it had puppies. You can go get your new dog at the vault. But also the dog would never die. Like can't just program a game where your dog's always dying on you. That's the saddest thing ever. Yeah, it sucks. So the, their dogs are just never gonna die. But it really is funny when you, like, two humans show up. You and, uh, I don't know, for instance, uh, Kate, best girl, show up. Yeah, somebody's gonna fire at her, but when you show up with a dog and a guy's like, yeah, that one's getting the nuke. That one's getting the... Somebody nuked your dog. It sound like Scooby-Doo getting hit in the face with a nuclear explosive Gee, device. Yeah. Ooh? Uh, hey, multiverses? Send us my, send me my alpha key. <laughs> we would love to play it. Get some of the Ultra Instinct Shaggy. It, is, it, is that what they actually call him, though? No, What no. do they call him? It's just Shaggy. Just Shaggy? Yep. I, no introductions needed. The moves all have names, but I don't know what his power-up move, because his neutral B is just power-up for a short while. He buffs himself with a Super Saiyan aura, and it's just crazy. God, I want to play the memes melee. It looks... So, shout out shout out to Matthew Lillard, who does the voice of Shaggy, who also played Shaggy in the live-action movie. They just brought him back. It, it, that is absolutely fantastic. Ke Kevin Conroy? This is Batman. I don't think they got anybody new. No battle? Uh, <laughs> so you could just run past them? Oh. Uh, the one brain cell we share is having a tough time. Oh, C Dot! Jira and Mia. C Dot evolves into. Nutkin. <laughs> You. <laughs> I made a guess and I had a 50 50 shot. Nuzleaf? <laughs> Nuzleaf! <laughs> I had. They're look. both grass type, aren't they? Yeah. Oh, this is not a good match for me. Lotad's grass and water. I think? <laughs> Nutkin. Nutkin. Alright, if we catch one. That's it. <sighs> No, no, who does think... Nuzleaf evolve into? He evolves into, like, the samurai-looking one with the leaves for hands, like, the long white hair. Mm. You know what I'm talking about? Yes. That's a good Pokemon. I know he gets a dark typing. Yeah, he did. Um, Nuz... Nuz Nut. Nuz... Nutleaf. No thanks. Um... Damn, what was that one's name? I feel like it didn't even have anything in it that was, like, seed or leaf or anything like that. I feel like Nuz was there. Nuz? Something Nuz. leaf. I don't remember. Well, he's dead, so we'll never find out. Check the Pokedex. Check the Pokedex. The Pokedex, I just have, uh, sit, sit around. Let me check. Pardon me entering the other side of the room. Let's find out here. Is this the guy give us the fishing pole? We would... I don't... We don't need a magic card. I'm a Pokemon expert. You don't know me. Fisherman Ivan. Yeah, we got magic I card. I want there to be an anime where somebody just, like, have the Pokeball and you know the fishing 
pole like this guy, like that is winging at you. That's how they catch him. I never thought about that. That's got to be in the anime. It's got to be. There's got to be an episode where you're like in season one. Un momento. I'm a fish expert. Just free XP. He's a. Is that what he said? A fish expert. He's a fishing expert. Look he's a, I think he said he was a water Pokemon expert. Actually, to be fair, pretty much the only thing you can catch in these in this body of water is magic cards. So you can't really blame him for not having dick shit. I thought you'd catch better um, better water Pokemon if you had a better fishing Goldine? rod. Goldeen? Maybe? I like Goldeen. Another forgotten Pokemon. Sea King. One of my favorite fish Pokemon. Sea King's awesome. Sea King. Like the... The evolved form of Goldeen. Um, wasn't there, um... I was thinking of the evolved form of Horsey. It was Horsey, Seedra, then... See, was it Horsey? Yeah. Kingdra. Kingdra, yeah, that was it. Also... Man, these names. Forgotten, also forgotten Pokemon. Horsey's pretty much dead to the world. Remember that? Uh, you know, the seal? Uh, seal. Yeah, it was seal and dugong, which if I'm... Correct, is just a kind of seal? Is that a thing? Let's see here. I gotta find out. Shift tree. Shift tree. That's it. Didn't have anything from it in there. So now Magikarp. This man really caught How? three Magikarps. I thought he only had one. No, I'm just getting experience for Poochiana here. I think Magikarp has the worst IV level that you get for training. Look, he's playing the long game. He's gonna have like three Gyaradoses. But our EVs are gonna suck. Oh. If my understanding of EVs is correct. Yeah, that's It might fair. not be. It's fine. It's all secret. We ain't min-maxing here. Damn, dog Doggo's just not that strong. It's free XP. Yeah, at this point, we're just worried about the face, the hard levels. Not the moves. The, the soft, squishy EV levels. Magikarps are the worst EVs. They... That is my understanding. If I'm... The rarer the Pokemon, the better the EV training you get when you beat it, I think? Two cherry berries. Quote me on that. Some cherry berries. Oh, Ruby and Sapphire had the clubhouse. The underground? I'm not it? sure I'd eat something called a Lepa Berry. That sounds poisonous. Really do. If you see berries growing in a loamy soil, feel free to take them. And as I was a kid trying to figure out what the fuck loamy meant, they really use that word a lot. I think that's just a translation thing? No, uh, loam is another word for soil, I think. Some soily soil. Some soily soil. That sounds about right. I remember seeing the reflections of my character in the in the puddles, as a, when I was a kid. It's just I was it like, it doesn't get better than this. Beat that, Last of Us. <laughs> my only rival. It's graphics. I played Ocarina of Time. Rustboro. We made it to a city. Russell Boro. Russells. Russell City. Russell's a, if I remember correctly, a real town. In England, Scotland, Ireland, somewhere on that half of the, somewhere on this planet. Some more Pokeballs. We can't buy Ultra Balls yet, but they gave us one. They gave us a Great Ball, I think. Uh, I wonder when you, that's not fair. Hype us up on all this, uh, all this catching power and then not even let us buy it. That's all we'll buy, I think. Probably all we need. Who needs potions? Come on. We might need potions. Uh, we, we'd have to stop. Look at those barely child-shaped children. Just dots. Uh, you could tell she's a child from the bow. They, they really did have to do it that way. When I get bigger, I'm going to go places. But, I mean, by the rules of the world of Pokemon, you're probably about there. You only need to be a child. Welcome to the Pokemon Center. I 
I feel like the first time a child didn't come home from their Pokemon journey, that, like, they would just outlaw this. You would think so. I mean, we've seen Pokemon die being applied dead, and I think there's a couple of times we see Pokemon straight up die. There was the Luxray and the Power of Us movie, which is honestly one of my favorite newer Pokemon movies. It's pretty good. You just see a Luxray just straight up just die of exposure. Okay. Is left out the in the cold. Next route. I don't think there was ever a concept of a trainer dying. No, no, no. A trainer did die in um, the secret of Lucario and the secret of Mew. What was that guy? Aaron? The guy with the Lu Lucario. Didn't he die? Yes. Isn't he like frozen in crystal? PG 13 died. But, you know, he died while he was frozen, so it's cool. Like, he just off-cameraed it. Rated G died. Yeah, okay. Got it. That's the only one I could think of that has ever died. That was a good movie, too. He had a cool hat. He did, he had a whole-ass cool outfit. I liked him. Is, is that the is that the time space that Legends of Arceus takes place in? What, the movies? Uh, the Sir Aaron time space. If it does, it takes place before that, because during the Sir Aaron timeline, people had Pokemon. Man, I hope that's his name. Sir Aaron, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, otherwise. Alright, the Ninkata. This is a wild. We do... I would like to have a Ninkata. Right. We gotta have a bug. Gotta have... We don't have a bug type, do we? Even though, historically, they're not that great, I like Ninkata a lot. This... This one might be all right. I forget what causes the the evolutionary split, though. Is it a day-night thing? I, I, if I remember correctly, I feel like it was something stupid, like you had to have him down to one health. For the... Hmm. For the one where he's, like, dead. The one that has no attacks work on him except Psychic, which would be fucking fantastic to have. Oh, grab my phone! The, grab the Pokédex. We don't need to know it yet. But... Let's see here. Oh, I killed it. Well... I'm gonna figure out. Never mind. Oh, that eh, might come up again. Uh, Ninkata. Not catching this Zigzagoon. Shedinja. Should end you? Yeah. Okay, yeah, there is some janky stuff we need. Um, you can... You get Ninkata? And then you can get Ninjask? Which is the ghost? Uh... Shed Ninja. Shed Ninja? Yeah, that's the ghost one. Okay, yeah. Just the, the shed. Got you. Old molted bug type. Let's see. I don't know. I, you know, I don't think I'd like a bug type Pokemon in real life. Oh, is that it? Just cut all my gigantic moth. When you evolve Ninkata into Shed in, or into Ninjask, if you have an empty slot in your party, you will also get a Shedinja because it is the shedded skin of you Ninkata. What? Was that how it was back then? That doesn't sound right. That sounds cool, Are though. you sure? That doesn't sound quite right. No, I don't think Pokemon does turn into two Pokemon. Well, that's how it works in the remake of Diamond and Pearl. That's why I'm going to check. Maybe that's a new thing. That's Looking so up cool. again. It makes sense, thematically. Yeah, okay, let's see. How to get a Shedinja? Hmm. Nope, that appears to be it. No, really? Evolve your Ninkata at level 20 and make sure you have a one Pokeball 
in an empty spot in your party, and you will automatically get a Shedinja with it. All right. I don't remember that. I also... Moving away from the mic. I also recall the fact that... Shedinja only has one HP. Naturally. <gasps> because he can't be hit by any attacks except psychic attacks. Okay, that's fair. Due to his typing. That's... Could be cheat-ish, considering I don't think the AI makes note of type advantages. Is that a thing? Yeah. I did, I don't know. I didn't know if the AI actually looked at the typing and oh, made a decision that, on it. That I don't know. I don't feel like maybe in the newer games. Probably depends who's AI. I feel like gym leaders should. Gym leaders will probably cap on that, but like. This wild Pokemon just keeps scratching. Yeah. So I would Harden. say that Shedinja, Ninjask also has a really high base speed, which is great. But uh, Shedinja, I, I remember using it to great extent because of his janky bullshit. Hey. There we go. Hey. Speaking of the jank. Get that sand attack on this dog. Oh, that's always good. I did not appreciate the sand attack as a kid. I didn't appreciate most status moves as a kid just because I was like, that doesn't do damage. Bad move. Oops. Why would anybody use that? Let me... Yeah, well, it's the it's the Final Fantasy fourteen issue. How am I going to heal or tank and do more damage at the same time? Then you just forget about that. Where did you catch a Meryl around here? Oh. Zumaru would be great. We already have a water type, though. Yeah, we do. But soon we'll have a ground type, so we can have a water type. But if we if we get a Lombre, we'll have another water type. Lombre and Ludicolo might be the exception to that rule. I'll make an exception. Mm, got the box of Smudkip eventually. We got it. Yeah. I'd be fine with that if we had Ludicolo. Swap swap the starter out. For some cool homebrew Pokemon uh, partying. I hate talk about swapping the starter out when she's doing all the work. I feel like a lot of people do just so they can have a more uh, personalized party. Nobody personalizes their party anymore. All they do is just uh, stack up on all six legendaries that they can get and run the same thing as everybody else. I say, I mean, that that's how some play, you know? Just like you get a starter, maybe like one other good Pokemon. I think you just wait till the end of the game and catch legendaries. And I never liked that. Um, I like a lot of legendaries. They have cool designs. But for me, Pokemon is about training the Pokemon that you like. Now, get get what you like. Fair enough. Now, I'll put a Rayquaza on my team. I'll put a Deoxys on my party because I like those Pokemon. But for the most part, I'm going to use stuff like um, Gardevoir, Lopunny, Salazzle. Salazzle's a good one. Salazzle's great. Oh. You gotta get that waifu team going. Yeah. And I'm like, them Salazzle look. girls. And, I, and I'm like, look, God, Salazzle's tough to catch. You have to have a female Salandit, and they, like, the ratio of male to female is like 10 to 1. So you have a very small chance of finding a female Salandit, which makes shiny hunting a major pain in the ass, but I caught one. The shiny Salazzle? Turns into a white sal uh, Salazzle. Kinda, yeah. Alright. Exploud is also a fucking beast. Okay. You, you might got me on this one. Wishmer, Loudred, and Exploud. Yeah. The, the, this isn't a trainer encounter, right? Oh, no. Oh, no. No, it's uh, not a trainer encounter. I didn't... I didn't mean to... <laughs> I did. I'm sorry, little one. Now yeah, we might find another one. Fuck. Man, it's a zigzagoon. It's a zigzagoon. Let's see if we can find a wishmer, uh, and then we'll uh, we'll be out, we'll be out of time. Let's 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 end the episode after we see if we can find a wishmer. Wismer? There's no H in there. I think it's. I think it's Wismer. Wismer. Uh, whisper. Yeah, that's the one. Wismurmur. Uh, sound names. Mm -hmm. Hey Pokemon, add a add a sound type, and then fuck everything up. 
Loudrid. Doesn't doesn't what was it? Neuvern? Neuvern, yeah. Does that have like a sound thing? Yeah, he's like echolocation. Neuvern's hey, badass. Here we go. Neuvern's one of my favorite new Pokemon. He's so cool. Um, Tomas Shroomple, yeah. Let's yeah, see if he's got this, it. This might be better. Upper is cool. Fuck. I forget, I forget. Is that the one that knocks you away? No. no, you have to use it. It's like roll out. He keeps using it. Okay, well, we'll just absorb. Hope we can. That's not good. No, this is fine. It's bad. I think it like roll out. Yeah, if it gets stronger every time. We got to go to the the mud kid. Go to the poles. Oh come on, that's just that's just sad. That's, oh, that's oh, so sad. Oh, that's not good. Not not a big fan of the this mushroom right Wismer now. This might be above. Our pay grade. Uh, All right, we need we need to fill out this party though. Maybe a mud slap will be j just, uh, just a gentle mud slap. He's just over there. Um, okay, we might have it. Yeah, uh, if I hit him again, he'll die. Yeah, let's try it out. Oh shit! If he hits you again, you might die. The next hit's gonna be harder. He's just screaming, and you just took a fistful of mud and just go slapped. pokeball. Open palm smacked. Let's see, come on. Get it. Oh, no. Uh, if you push B three times, you have a guaranteed catch. I don't I don't think that's how it works at all. <laughs> that, was the, that was the playground rumor back in the day. Tap A and B. Tap A and B, tap B, whisper sweet see, nothings not... to your Game Boy Advance. No! Aw, oh, dick. Ma'am, we don't have a... S oh, Ooh. you might... You know what? Get let let throw one more. I say use it. Let's go. Yeah, we gotta have more Pokemon, and Wizmer's not a bad choice at all. No, this is a valuable member. It He's beating the crap out of me right valuable now. Valuable member of the DK crew. What the? F gotcha. Uh, for a second there, I thought it was just like no, no, no. I'm used to the Pokeball like flashing or something. Yeah, that's what I was waiting on. Oh, he's very quiet. Till it. Since it's danger, it starts crying in an ear-splitting volume. He's just like, <laughs> oh yeah, okay. Uh, 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 what's a loud band? So, Slayer. I mean, you have Slayer the Wismer, but honestly, the the JoJo slash Pink Floyd reference should be Echoes or Echo. I'm all right with that. Echoes. Yeah, let's do Echoes. You got it. All right. Echoes Act 1. Act... Ecto, Echoes Act 1. Echoes Act 1. He, he, he'll evolve as yeah. the series goes on. Alright, before we go in the cave, uh, unfortunately that is all the time we have for Densetsu Rama today. On our next episode, we will be going into the ver... Uh, ver... 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 ver, ver turf. Verdon turf. Surf and turf. Leaking Rustboro and Verdon turf. The rooster tunnel. The tunnel project has been cancelled. Shit. Well, you're on your own. Yep. All right, see you all, all next right, time. All right, see you guys.